All right, so what I want to do now is show you how to log on to Gmetrics and what you should do while you're in Gmetrics to take your testing and training modes. All right, Gmetrics is going to be our uh, training platform for our certification test. So what you want to do is go to gmetrics.net up at the top uh, in your Internet Explorer, Internet browser, anything you use for your Internet. And you're going to sign in with your username and password. If you uh, don't have an account, you can go down to uh, – you can get an account right here, sign up here. Once you've signed in and created your account, you're going to come to a screen that looks like this. Uh, this is if you have a course code. If you don't have a course code, they are on Canvas. You can look them up on Canvas using the announcements page. You'll see uh, Gmetrics course codes. Um, so you'll come into your dashboard, uh, and you'll have all these options over here. And what you'll have, what you'll want to do is click Start a New Test. Right here, we've got our Adobe uh, test that we can take. If you don't have Adobe installed on your home computer, I recommend using Adobe CC 2015 because you don't have to have any uh, Adobe software installed, and it's and it's a, a lot of the same stuff, uh, especially just vocabulary-wise and all that. So what you're going to do is click here to start a 2015 test. Now, as of right now, we're only using Illustrator, Dreamweaver, Photoshop, InDesign, and Premiere Pro. We're not testing an animator flash just yet, but let's say you want to take an Illustrator test. So we're going to click here on Illustrator, and now we've got 2013 options and 2015 options. And what I would do is just click on the training mode of the test you want to take. Uh, honestly, don't worry about taking the 2013 test right now. You're not. I don't need you to worry about those. Just work on the trainings for 2015. So we'll click training mode. You'll get the spinny thing. And it'll pop up. You might have to enable Flash for this to run if you're using Chrome, uh, but it'll load in. And you'll see that it does exactly, it looks almost exactly like our Illustrator window on our computer. From there, you'll have uh, the directions for the question at the top. If you're in training mode, it'll have this little light bulb right here that can give you all the step-by-step -step on how to do it. So you'd select the image. Select it. Select the drop down for image trace. Okay. And then select sketched art. So we're going to come down here to sketched art. And that's all, that's all you got to do. Then you hit next. You have your answer is correct. There's the explanation for why it's correct. And you click next. And keep going with it. So what you need to do is take all four of the 2015s at least. If you have Adobe um, on your computer uh, installed 2018 or higher, you can take the 2018 trainings, and they will load through your Adobe software. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to email me or leave me a message on Canvas. Thanks.